Hey guys, welcome to my world, it's Dora. In this video, I will be showing you guys how I take care of this wig and how I wash it. Now, this wig requires very little maintenance. Uh, I don't have to brush it very often, if at all, because it's a bob, so it doesn't really get tangled as much as long wigs, and it doesn't get matted also in the back because it is very, very short in the back. And it's also really silky, so I don't really need to use a brush or a comb. I can just use my fingers and that does the job. So maintenance and caretaking for this wig is very minimal, which I'm so thankful for because I don't want to have to pull out a brush or take a brush with me wherever I go just to upkeep this hair. Uh, I like using my fingers or just doing a little bit of a shake uh, for the wig to get it back to where it needs to be. Now with washing this hair, I use conditioner only. I don't use shampoo because shampoo tends to dry out my wigs and it tends to dry out my hair or your hair in general. Uh, so conditioner does the job. It does clean your hair and it makes it really, really soft. And that is all you need for this wig is conditioner. So I will show you guys how I wash my hair. So all you need is conditioner. I use a strawberry version of Suave. And then I go in with my brush and the wig itself. Now you want to make sure the hair is wet, of course. And I just take a couple droppings of this conditioner. Uh, I came out not so luxurious looking, but whatever. And I just work that into the wig. Just get that conditioner all over the hair if you can. And then I go in with my brush and just brush the hair out just to make sure the conditioner can get to the places that my hands couldn't get it. And then I just rinse that out. It's that easy. Now if you want your hair to be a little bit softer or silkier, just make sure you can leave the conditioner in your hair longer than I did. I just got it in there to make sure the hair was washed and rinsed it out. But again, if you want it to be soft, just leave it in there for a couple more minutes. And that's the result. Now I let it air dry. I do not use a blow dryer. And that is the finished result. So that concludes this video. Again, as you can see, not much went into this wig. It's so easy. Uh, and I'm so thankful for Wig Logic for making this wig very, very easy to take care of and easy to manage. Because I had trouble in the past with wigs that would get tangled and matted and I would have to get rid of them after a month or so. And I do take care of them. But with this wig, you don't have to put in that much effort. Literally, it's so easy and so soft and silky. And I'm just so glad. I'm so glad that it's this easy to take care of. Yeah, again, so many great things to say about this hair. And I will leave the wig info down below and the company's info down below so you guys can check it out so yeah that concludes this video i hope you guys enjoyed it make sure to like this video if you enjoyed and subscribe to my channel to look out for more videos and uh, yeah that's it this video was very short this wig does not take much at all like i really wish i would have had all of these things that i used to make this wig so nice and silky but literally I throw this wig on and it's this nice. Like I, sometimes I don't even use a brush or a comb because like, it's just so silky. I literally just throw it on and call it a day. Yeah, thank you guys again for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye. I don't feel